United States v. Paramount Pictures, 1948. In 1938, the federal government filed an antitrust lawsuit against eight major motion picture companies, alleging they conspired to control the industry through their ownership of film distribution and exhibition. One of the most powerful tools of the industry was a process called block booking, whereby independent theater owners signed contracts with studios that required them to show a group of films. In 1940, the motion picture companies lost in federal district court on the grounds that their actions fixed prices and created a monopoly in violation of the Sherman Antitrust Act. Despite agreeing to guidelines, the companies did not fully comply. The federal government took the industry to court again, but lost. The case was appealed all the way to the U.S. Supreme Court. In a 7-1 to one decision, the Supreme Court ruled that the actions of motion picture companies were in violation of the Sherman Antitrust Act. The court ruled that block booking and the ownership of theaters by movie producers was a monopoly. This changed the movie industry forever.